Why do you like a cycling tour? Freedom, fresh air. Mm. I like to meet people. I like everybody, more or less. <laughs> Would you like me to get your drink? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to go and get some drink then. Uh, you see the bikes here, the uh, uh, trishore bikes uh, being used uh, by volunteers to take elderly people out for bike rides. Um, and we have Torbe, who's 99, with us today. She's been chatting all along. Uh, so I like to take her out because she's really good fun, but I can also help her with her limited mobility. I come on, I'm 99. <laughs> I'm soon 100. And I should sit home and be bored. No, I like to anything. Fresh air and people and nature and get out. I like people and meet people. It's a great way of fighting uh, loneliness because that is really, in my book, one of the, the biggest problems that we have in society today is the fact that uh, people are sitting on their own, lonely. It's the way we've structured our society and I'd like to help uh, solve that. We can just cycle around in the supermarket and, <laughs> and do shopping, is that okay? Yeah. <laughs> I think that would be really cool. I had a dad who was suffering from uh, multiple sclerosis all my childhood and so um, I knew firsthand what it meant to be mobile and I had, I had to be his legs and then many many years later when I saw an old man sitting on a bench not being able to move very far away I just got the idea that uh, I got the strong urge that I wanted to help him too and in the meantime these wonderful bikes had been invented so I just got one of them and started cycling so I guess it was just uh, history that caught up with me. I like young people, they're fantastic. Some of them are so clever. Yes, I believe in them. But I think it's a, not a nice word we give them. Do you think you could have done something different so that no. the world would be better today? The world? Yes. I am not so arrogant, no. The world, no. You don't think... I tried in the war. During the war, yes? Yeah. So what happened during the war, Torben? What happened during the war? We were sabotaging all the German things, what they did, and factories they used. And so you worked in the resistance? Absolutely, yeah. Everybody should do that. Yeah. So you think it's people's responsibility to act yes. when there's something wrong? Yeah. And how, how about today, you know, when a lot of the problems in the world today have to do with, um, you know, the world heating up, climate change, yeah. what can people do now? Yeah, they can start living more simple and uh, not use so much, not throw away so much, and eat less. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Bike is a solution to so many things. It's a solution to loneliness, to uh, all the you know the mobility issues in cities, uh, obesity, climate. You know, you name it. The bike is the answer.